Hello and welcome to Goa 365's News Bulletin with me, Ramona. Scarlet's lawyer Vikram Verma has now held former Chief Minister Digambar Kamath and his then Congress government responsible for allowing the accused to destroy the evidence of rape and murder case of British teenager. Scarlet's mother Fiona McKeon has thus now requested Prime Minister Narendra Modi to order the CBI to probe into the angle of destroying evidence and get them punished. The rape and murder case of 19-year-old Scarlett Keeling in 2009 was first investigated by Goa Police and then by the Central Bureau of Investigation. The Goa's Children's Court, however, acquitted both the accused for lack of evidence. According to lawyer advocate Vikram Verma, the delay in filing FIR and handing over the case to the CBI were the two prime reasons to get the acquittals. He also holds the Gambar Kamath government responsible for this deliberate delay. We know for sure, at least the evidence in the court, the trial court shows that uh, the Goa police registered the FIR 20 days after the crime. And these 20 days was enough time for the criminals to destroy the evidence. What the evidence on the trial court also shows that despite uh, the promise of uh, handing it over to the CBI on the 27th of March 2008 by the Chief Minister Mr. Digambar Kamat, the Goa government actually handed over or wrote a letter of consent to the central government on the 6th of May 2008 and the CBI came into the picture on the 5th of June. So by their conduct, the government or whoever were the specific officers in the government, they have provided the criminals 108 days to destroy all evidence. After the verdict, Scarlett's mother has now requested the Prime Minister to order CBI to probe into the angle of destroying the evidence. Uh, the conduct of the CBI seems to have been compromised, that they did not arrest other people who had violated crimes, who were uh, using cocaine and storing cocaine, etc., etc. And uh, the fact that the acquittal was done on the lack of evidence, right, we understand that this case required not only to be looked at from the perspective of the limited evidence available but also to investigate and prosecute those who have destroyed the evidence. Additionally, those authorities who have provided the time to the criminals to destroy the evidence should also be looked at. There is adequate provisions under the Indian Penal Code and matters must be investigated and prosecuted under those provisions. That the only person who could possibly intervene in the matter and take it so that the entire uh, complexity of the crime is investigated is the Prime Minister of India. I obviously I have hope but I, I try not to have any expectations again after the um, verdict in the court. Um, I think I've got more of a chance of getting a, a fair um, judicial um, response from the Prime Minister that's why um, we thought he'd be the best person to go to. Goa 365 Bureau in Panji.